serikali imetahadharisha watu walioidhinishwa kumiliki bunduki humo nchini dhidi ya kuzitumia vibaya kufuatia kwanza kwa muda wa mwezi mmoja wa huruma kwa wale wanaomiliki silaha hizo kinyume cha sheria zilizo uh, kuzisalimisha Waziri wa Usalama wa Taifa Dr. Fred Matiangi aliyezindua mpango huo aliyahimiza mataifa wote wanachama wa mkataba wa muungano wa Afrika wa msamaha huu kutekeleza ipasavyo ili kuhakikisha silaha zinazomilikiwa kiharamu zimesalimishwa. Mwezi wa Septemba ni mwezi wa msamaha kwa wale wanaomiliki silaha kinyume cha sheria kwenye mataifa wanachama wa muungano wa Afrika kuzisalimisha bila kuchukuliwa hatua zozote za kisheria. Shughuli hiyo ilizinduliwa jijini Nairobi na waziri wa usalama Fred Matiangi. Mtafiti mkuu wa masuala ya silaha Francis Wairagu alieleza wasiwasi kuhusu athari za kuwepo kwa bunduki ndogo ndogo humu nchini. We lose our wildlife. We lose many other natural resources that we have because even mining is, is affected when that happens. Maoni yaliyoongwa mkono na Inspector Generali wa polisi Hillary Muti ambaye alitahadharisha kwamba ikiwa hatua madhubuti hazitachukuliwa vizazi vijavyo vitaathirika pakubwa. They constitute a serious threat to peace, security and stability in Africa. The scourge of the illicit weapons, their illicit proliferations and the use uh, contribute to the disruption of livelihood and economic activities and undermining efforts to realize the goal of creating a conflict free integrated and prosperous Africa. Waziri Matiangi alitoa fursa hiyo kuahimiza wa Kenya walio na silaha kinyume cha sheria kuzisalimisha wakati huo msamaha. This month of September is very helpful to you especially if you voluntarily uh, surrendered uh, the fire uh, and then went to the local police station or to the local chief or assistant chief's office and surrendered the fire. Um, that is what will help you. But you know what the law is. Matiangi pia alitoa onyo kali kwa raia wa kigeni humu nchini walio na silaha kinyume cha sheria akisema watachukuliwa hatua kali. We are going to be most ruthless to foreigners and neighbors who engage in this kind of trafficking. We will no longer have those kinds of discussions we are told by people that oh you know uh, let us have this discussion under the East African community. It's fine and dandy when it is your citizens who are trafficking arms and moving around the country. It's fine and dandy and regionalism becomes important when it is your citizens who are crossing our country and probably even selling arms that are going to take away the lives of our people. Wanaomiliki silaha hizo ambao wanaleseni walitahadharishwa dhidi ya kuzitumia vibaya. Isufar, Darubini ya Channel 1.